This review is on the movie Buffalo Boys. I'm the anger guy. I'm going to tell you like it is. Director for the film Buffalo Boys is Mike Huyen. Mike is also a producer and writer, and is known for Hitman Agent 47 and Crazy Rich Asians. The cast was Ariel Bayou as Jamar, the older brother, Yoshi Sadarso as Suo, the younger brother, Pavita Pierce as Kiona, Tio Pakusad Wo as uh, Reina, the uncle, Daniel Adnan, Ray Out, Bosey Maker as Van Tri Ake, Happy Selma, and Donnie Damara. In the 19th century of, on the island J Java, a young Captain Van Tri Ake and his Dutch soldiers kills Sultan Hamza. Sultan had two sons. Sultan's brother, Arena, took the two infant brothers and they fled the country. They went halfway around the world to America Wild West. After working on the railroads and learning the cowboy way of life, the boys, the Uncle Arena, tells them it's time to return to their homeland and avenge their father's death. Back on Indonesia soil, the hunt for their father's killers begins. Along the way, they meet some villagers, including Kiona, the rebellious and beautiful headsman daughter, who Sowo falls for. The uncle and the boys soon find out that the dangerous Van Traik still rules the area. Their presence puts the village in danger, quickly turning their quest for revenge into a fight for freedom. With the odds stacked against them, the uncle and his nephews use his skills they learn from the wilds of America to face Van Traik and his army in a showdown for justice. I watched the previews for the film Buffalo Boys, and to me it looked like an old American western meets Asian culture with machetes. But actually, watching the opening of the film, I started to see foreign languages and symbols. I go to myself, uh-oh, subtitles! Well, there were subtitles in the film, but after a while, I just read them and felt it was a part of the movie and forgot all about them. I am interested in how the writers met Will you in Raymond Lee and Ray uh, Mock Kareem came up with the ID for this story. Maybe the IDs came from what was read at the introduction of the movie. It read, this film is like when worlds of facts and folklore collide. I did research on the subject because I didn't know the history of the Dutch Empire in the Indonesia island of Java. I believed in all the characters the actors portrayed, the costumes and the settings for the villages and the settlements that looked like cowboy towns in America. They were excellent. This film was classified as an action adventure. I classify the movie as a drama. The movie had action at the end and it was expected. There was dramatic action during the film, but nothing that glued me to my seat. I didn't see anyone looking into the camera during the film, but I felt it was hard for some extras not to do so. When I see a man riding a buffalo, I think it I really think it was a water buffalo. It looked genuine. After watching him, I thought, that's how the movie's going to end. Tribes from all over the countryside, like the film Avatar, comes together, and half of them will be riding a buffalo, and that would be the cavalry come to save the day. Out of ten, I and me classifying this film as a drama, I give this film a seven. It's no action adventure film. Hey, thank you for watching, and thank you for subscribing.